system software. This kind of software solves issues related to the running of the computer system correctly. The operating systems like Windows XP, Windows 7, Windows 8 and Linux are the best examples of system software. Other software which are part of the operating system that deals with correct functioning of the computer system can also be deemed as system software. System software controls the various operations performed by the computer hardware. It helps the user to operate the computer system. System software is of three types. Operating system, utility programs, language processors. Operating system. An operating system is a software that controls the overall activity of a computer system. It provides an interface between the user and the computer hardware. The following are the tasks performed by an operating system. Operating system manages the system's resources. For example, it allocates memory and CPU time to the task currently being executed. Operating system manages the transfer of data to and from various peripherals such as keyboard, mouse, scanner and printer. Operating system manages the system security and performance. It provides a way for application software to communicate with the hardware. For example, if you give a command to print, the operating system gives an instruction to the printer to start printing. Examples of operating systems used nowadays are Android, Microsoft Windows, Mac OS X and Windows Phone. There are many types of operating systems. Let us study about some of them. Single User Operating System A single user operating system allows only one user to access the data or to work on an application at a time. The single user operating system used nowadays is Windows. Multi-user operating system. Multi-user operating system allows several users to access the same data at the same time. For example, Unix, Linux are multi-user operating system. Multitasking operating system. Multitasking means the ability of the computer to run two or more applications at the same time. It allows multiple programs to share a computer's resources. For example, sending a file on the internet while listening to music. You may also send a file for printing besides doing the above tasks. The operating system takes care of printing and other tasks being performed at the same time. Windows is a multitasking operating system. Utility Programs Utility program is a system software that improves the operations of an operating system by providing additional and specialized functionality to it. It helps to keep your system in good condition by eliminating errors. Some utility softwares come with Windows. These are available in the System Tools section of Accessories. These software are different from the other types of software. It is related to the fine-tuning and management of the operating system, computer hardware or application software. Utility software usually deals with a number of small tasks. Some of the popular utilities are as follows. Backup Utility It allows you to take the backup copy of data or information on a disk. Antivirus It scans for computer viruses. Data Compression It can compress the contents of a disk. Network Utilities 
it analyzes the computer's network connectivity. File managers, it provides a way to perform different operations such as deleting, renaming, moving, merging data files, etc. Disk management, it includes the operations like disk cleaners, checkers, disk formatting, etc. Language processors. A language processor is also known as a language translator. As you know, computer programs are written in high-level languages, but the computer understands only the machine language. Thus, a translator software is used to convert the high-level language codes to machine language codes. When a program is fed into the computer, language translator automatically converts the program into machine language and checks its syntax for errors. There are three types of language translators. Let us study about these translators. Assembler An assembler is a software that converts the assembly language instructions into the right machine codes. Interpreter An interpreter is a software that converts the high-level program codes into machine language. It translates the high-level language program line by line. A line is translated, executed, and then it moves to the next line. If an error is found on any line, it is reported to the user, and the execution of the program is stopped. Compiler A compiler also converts the high-level language programs into the machine language. It converts the complete high-level language program into machine code in one go. If any error is found, the whole program has to be recompiled again. No more. Lot of languages cannot easily be categorized as high-level or low-level languages. Like C is compared to assembly language, but there is enough scope for high-level abstraction in C.